Hey y'all, welcome back for another video. I'm Jasmine or Jasmine Monique. So if you're returning, welcome back. And if you're new here, thanks for coming. Um, first, I know that I've been gone for a little bit, guys. Um, honestly, I've had reels of videos saved in my iPad, ready to edit them and upload them for all of you guys. But I recently had a death in my family. So I've just been taking some time to deal with that. It's been pretty hard on me and my family, so I've just been, you know, working around with all of that. And then also, I've had a lot of things that I've had to do for school, so that's sort of the premise of this video. So, um, I go to Ohio State University. That is the NNP program that I'm enrolled in. And part of my program is, most of my program is online, so I usually interact with my classmates and my professors via Zoom. However, um, a couple times throughout the program, we are asked to go down to um, the Ohio State University's campus in Columbus, Ohio. So that is what I did over the weekend. Um, I had a really good time. It was great. So this video is pretty much just going to be like a little mini vlog to sort of give you guys an idea of what going down to Columbus was like, um, what my experience was, some of the things that I did. Um, it was a really good time for me because I actually did get to go with my husband because he had some business that he had to handle in Columbus as well. So we went down for the weekend and then Monday and Tuesday, I had a full day of simulations. So I got to practice a lot of the skills that I've spent the last almost two semesters learning. Um, so it was a really good experience. So stay tuned. I'm going to put some videos and a bunch of pictures. I tried to get as much stuff as I can, but also, you know, I was in simulation, so I couldn't have my phone out too much. But I'm also going to do a little debrief at the end. So I hope you guys enjoy. See you later. So the first day that I got there, all I pretty much did was check into the Airbnb. And then I did some studying. to prepare. Also, you guys get to see my husband for the first time. So there he is sleeping while I was studying. <laughs> So now we're on to day two, which is the first day of simulations. I was super nervous about all of the procedures. My anxiety started to get pretty high, so I actually woke up early just to review all of them before I went into the simulation okay. at 7.45. Y'all know that I always try to be honest with you about how I'm feeling in the moment. So we're going to have a tiny bit moment of vulnerability here. Vulnerability. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, it's early in the morning. It's like 7.30 and I work night shift. Y'all know that. So this morning I did have a moment. I got really nervous because today's our first day of um, simulations. So this is the first time that I'm gonna be working with a lot of my classmates in person and definitely was feeling some imposter syndrome, feeling like I wasn't prepared. Luckily, my wonderful husband is here and um, you know, he got me together this morning, he gathered me. But you know, I just like to highlight these moments because these are experiences that you have. Like even though I've been a NICU nurse for over two years now, and I'd say that I feel pretty confident in my practice, but just, you know, transitioning to that role of becoming a provider and thinking about all of the responsibility that I have, along with like me not having as much experience. I'm just showing you guys around what the simulation center at Nationwide Children's, which is where we're at, looks like. And next, you're going to get a sneak peek into some of the different skills that I got to practice. Hey, y'all. Welcome back. Um, so my background looks a little different first because I'm at work and I'm on my lunch break. But I did want to finish up this video for you guys and just sort of debrief how going to my simulations was so i definitely learned a lot i was upset that i wasn't able to get all of the footage for you guys but just so you could kind of see we just practiced different skills that um neonatal nurse practitioners would do when they're in the clinical setting so you saw that i got to practice inserting a pick line as well as inserting a chest tube some other things i did was i practiced radial lines i also practiced like inserting umbilical lines and suturing them in I got to practice my head to toe head to toe assessment as well as the thing that was really nerve wracking but also was um a great learning experience is I did two simulations in which I acted I acted as the nurse practitioner who was the main provider in the room for a delivery. Um so they sort of gave me a scenario and I had to go in and sort of figure out if I was actually the NNP what I would do. And that was um 
I'd say it was pretty terrifying, but also at the same time, it was really informative. I think that um, the entire time while I was getting prepared, I was, again, my imposter syndrome was getting the best of me. I'm really, really grateful for my husband. Shout out to you, Ryan, because he was constantly there telling me like, Jasmine, you're fine. You're smart enough. You're going to do this. It's going to be okay. So yes, but I think it was a really great experience. I'm glad that I got to do it. I'm excited to see what the future simulations will hold. And I hope that this was really informative for you guys. And I hope you guys were excited to see some of the things and procedures that you do as a neonatal nurse practitioner. And if you guys have any questions or want to know anything else about my simulation or anything else about my experience, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. And my lunch break is almost over and I haven't eaten anything yet. So this is where I'm going to say goodbye. Love you guys. Thank you so much. And I'll see you next time. Last but not least, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys later.